Hey guys, how's it going? RTG Ronnie here. Let's play our last path. I am getting stupider and stupider each video. I, I almost did it. I almost called it out past again, like I did in part 10. Well, so let's try that again. <coughs> hey guys, how's it going? RTG Ronnie here. Welcome to Outlast, part 11. Anyway, we seem to be progressing pretty fast. See the movie, so that's where I left the card. Okay? Hey! I need your help. Where are you? Yes, coming! I'm coming! Okay, I'm supposed to meet meet this guy in very random places. And he never never seems to be there, and even when he is there, he ends up disappearing again. Not a help he is. Okay. Okay, so let's check this place out. Ooh, pool. I'm actually quite good at pool. What? Oh, what the hell? Oh, just get around. Okay, fine. What? Whatever. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's still have a bit of a cough. Being quite poorly. You know what? I think I'll start with this area first. It seems safest. Wait, this is. Was this the way I. Was this the room I started in before? Yeah, it was the room I started in at, at the very first part. And so I must be getting quite near the end of the game. Anyway, no more messing about. Let's continue. It's all about making progress after all. And having the shit scared out of you. What are you doing? Will you? That's kind of confusing. Will you stop that? You're supposed to jump down there, you blank. Ooh, battery. And just in case I want to go back up, I can go up here. <laughs> oh, I see. I'm actually, I actually am supposed to go up here now. Do your thing. Do the whole. You freaking plank. Let go. Let go, damn. There you go. Setting on now. And who on earth is playing a piano? The only time will tell in this theater of the damned. Well, you are some bumbling jackass. Okay, maybe I'm not supposed to hug the wall like I initially thought. Maybe I'm just supposed to set sideways. No. Good for second or third broke the game. Ah, you know what? I'll have to edit all these parts out if I don't get it after this fry. Ah, there you go. So you have to face ledges in a certain manner in order to uh, pass them. Okay, that's it. Jump off, break your kneecaps. Good. Good job. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Okie dokie, yeah, I, I guess I'm gonna be chased by him now for uh disturbing his little musical performance. <laughs> Is 
That's what he said. The card is in the theater behind behind the screen, was it or something like that? Hmm. And no, logically, well, going by game logic. Jake. Exit interview recorded December 27th, 1985 in Los Alamos, New Mexico. Clearance Sierra Alpha. Subject, Dr. Rudolph Wernicke, 14866. The films are real. Uh, there was no alteration to the footage at all? No trickery? None. In June of 1943, you recorded three instances of spontaneous bleeding. Uh, half a dozen test subjects began to develop brain tumors? Yes. The autopsies revealed that the tumors were pure lead. It killed them? Can you explain why the results could not be reproduced in the United States? I have my theories. My homeland in those years. It's impossible to understand the things we felt, what we believed. The overwhelming fear, ecstatic rage, and English birds are insufficient. More than hope. The human mind in that environment is capable of extraordinary things. You're saying the experiment needed... The proximity to death. To overwhelming madness. Only a test subject who had witnessed enough horror was capable of activating the engine. Do you believe your test subjects achieved something supernatural? No. Do you think that they contacted something supernatural? Nothing is supernatural. Then what was it? You said Project Wallrider was a gateway. A gateway to what? Exit interview. The man sounds like Doctor Strange, or the man sounds like Doctor Strangelove, Strange Love, Strange Love's anemic brother. It's a 25-year-old audio recording. An interview with Doctor Warnick, Los Alamos, means government work. Warnick talks about spontaneous bleeding, tumors, psychosomatic uh, reactions, insufficient. Insufficiently disturbed people seems to walk a line between science and Nazi mysticism. Only a test subject who had witnessed enough horror was capable of activating the engine, the morphogenic engine. <clears throat> the engine the, the movie they're projecting, it gets in my head like a song you can't stop humming. I blink and see Rorschach tests that look like swarming insects and infected surgery wounds. The patient the patients talk about using the engine to conjure the wall rider. It's the buzzing I hear in my bones. Yeah, that's very interesting. You're very interesting. You know that? <gasps> oh god, lockers. I'm pretty sure we're going to run into Mr. Sakatet yet again. No doubt about it. You just wait. He's going to be at, at the end of this hallway. You have to find Verdicate. Only way. What a. Get out of there, you sack of muffins. Okay. I have to find a warning, but I thought warning was dead. I have two options in here. Straight up or straight ahead? I think I'll go straight ahead. Maybe, who knows? I might find more. Oh, documentation. So yes, exactly. Uh, from D 
dburton at markovcorp.us.com to gwillard at markovcorp.us.com subject refresh eating bacteria wash those hands regularly on September 9,034 you pay grant and wrote necrotizing uh, or necrotizing facilities or no wait not facilities ne necrotizing facilities really I fucking quit yeah, me too. Get on you. Okay, I guess that's all I came in here for was just to pick up a note. Good. Jolly. Jolly, 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 good. Ah. Okay, here we are in the projector room. We have to get a key card of some description. Let's close that shit out. That ah, doesn't matter now. If Mr. Sackett is uh, nearby, he's probably already heard me slamming that door. Battery, good, nice. Hey, hey, hey! What the hell was that about? Alrighty then. I clearly was not meant to go in there. It wasn't my destiny. And that destiny was not to be. Welcome back here, you son of a bitch. I'm gonna kick your ass, boy. Actually, I'm gonna kick your ass later. Again, the whole ledge routine. Can I just... You tit sandwich can't even close the door right, can you? Clearly he needs to take lessons in how to close a door quietly. second year I thought he was moving. Pick up your <gasps> Fine for Martin on the third floor. Okay, okay, no problem. What the hell? How did that door even open? Oh well, I'm not gonna question it. Because everything in this game defies Logic in every sense of the word. No, that door's still locked. And there's definitely no batteries in here, is there? hell did I just avoid that? I have some insane amount of luck. I, mean, I thought for sure I was going to be dead. Or I was going to be killed. Or deaded. What the hell? Who the hell are you? Eh, probably no one important. Now, hopefully 
the two nude butters won't start chasing my beautiful ass. Oh, oh god, a kitchen. This does not bode well, actually. It looks safe enough, if I do say so myself. I mean, there's no blood splatter splatters anywhere. Although, this ambient spikes to differ and who the hell are you? Uh, for Martin is that you? Oh no, it's you again, my friend. Uh, tell you what, sorry about disturbing your uh, musical performance there. Quite accidental if I, do, if I do say so myself. Uh, where the hell do I go? Ah, okay, I see. this place out. Oh. Hey there. Oh, it's you again. I remember you. You managed to get out those binds. Or that straight jacket, whatever the hell you're in. Fair play to you. Uh, notes. Static prayer. The static again. Patient knelt in prayer. Maybe he f he bought Father Martin's line of bullshit. Maybe he hears what I hear, but more clearly, maybe it's his way of, maybe he's it's his way out of this place. The priest called it the Gospel of Sand. All right then. Down to mosey on out of this place. Oh, I'm kind of, I'm kind of confused here. What the hell? Did I just glitch? <laughs> Did I just glitch through here or something? <laughs> what the hell? Okie dokie. I don't know how the hell I got through here, but I'm not going to question it. Hates sickness. God hates money. You know what? I've gotten too far to call this apart. I mean, oh, hi, you again. You're not going to attack me, are you? It's nice wings, by the way. Okay, what's going to happen here? Clearly, something. My job. You Not alone good. shall escape the Talva. This is your penultimate act of witness. The promise of the prophets was always freedom from death, and, and here it is. You will watch, record my death, my resurrection, and together we will be free. Okay. You are no longer. Danger. I fixed the elevator. It will take you to freedom. We will all of us be free. Now, my son.
Okay, either way, if it gets too long, I can just split this into two parts, so it can be part 11 and 12, and I'll just do a quick in intro, if, if that's the case, just say, explaining whether it's part 11 or 12. I mean, I'm just so hooked in it right now, I'm not going to just stop here. I can't believe Father Martin one up to Jesus Christ himself in shitty ways to die. And I don't believe I'm, I'm going to miss him. A way out? If you send the truth, now I've got a way out. And that's uh, right to tell. He wants me to spread his gospel. I'll tell the whole fucking world. Okay, I've got, uh... Plenty of screenshot material right here. Or thumbnail material. Okay, so hopefully these go. Don't attack me. Wait, hold on. I can't go into any of the stands. Or do. Whatever they are. Okie dokie, so I have a way out at last. Wait, am I supposed to go up here? Oh yeah, I am. I mean, I've no idea how far I've played into this part alone, but I intend on finishing the game right here, right now. And it's probably not going to be that easy. I mean, look, look. Oh god. Ooh shit. Shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I'm a dead man. He's right beside me, he's right beside me. I know if I put my head out, he'll just drag my ass and drag my ass out and beat me to a pulp. <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh god. I'm treating the worst here. I'm treating the worst, I'm treating the worst, I'm treating the worst. Oh god. Where is he? Oh god, I'm dead. I am bold. Hi. <laughs> this more than likely is going to be split up into two parts. I know I'm at the end, there's no point in starting um, from scratch. Oh, slow down there, Billy. Adios. Okay, need my camera. Okay, need to get out, need to get out, need to get out, need to get out. Need to get out. Oh shit. I want out of this place. Oh, I so want out of this place. Oh. Good, 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 good. <coughs> okay, I'm so out of here. So. Dump this bullshit. Done!
Okay. Okay, home stretch. This is it. This is it. Um. Oh. No, 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 no. What on earth? Nope. You promised me out in this game. You lied. Find another way out. Good, okay, I think I will. In fact, you know what? I think I will call this a part, I mean. Uh there could be there could be more to it, there could be a bit of a puzzle to finish it at the end. I'm not sure and I don't well, I'm not gonna Google it or, or YouTube it to try and find out. I'll just play by the books as they'd say. So I won't spoil the game for myself. Even though I've seen several let's plays on it, but it, I don't really remember all of the parts that well. So you know what to do. Like, share, comment and subscribe and I shall see you in the next one. So until then, see ya.